What is good, y'all? MJ here, and today we are gonna be watching Juice. This is a recommendation that I seen a lot in my comment section. You guys were just telling me to watch it over and over and over again, and I'm like, okay. I will watch it. Okay. So here we are watching Juice. This is a film from 1992. That is 10 years before I was even born. And it does have Tupac and Omar Epps in this movie. So I know it's going to be good. I just know it is. And if y'all know that the movie is going to be good, go ahead and click that Patreon link down in the description below to see my full reaction to this movie and any other movie and show that you would like to see. <laughs> So that's pretty much all I have to say. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. Like and subscribe. Let's go. I don't have any other dance moves. Comment down below for me to learn some dance moves or something, man, because I don't know any other dance moves, bro. I literally know like two dance moves and I just do that. It's so funny how you could tell how some of these movies are actually old. Like, it just looks old. Holy, Queen Latifah and Samuel L. Jackson is in this too? Oh my God, this is going to be a fire movie. I just know it. Where's this bass at? This looks familiar. All right, you ain't had to wake me up like that. That was just rude as hell. Excuse me, young man, what did you say? Nothing, ma. That's what I thought. Yeah, what the hell are you talking to your mama like that for? Pink now, whack his ass up, man. Ew, this man just scratched his balls. He just scratched all up in his crotch. Y'all, wash your hands if you finna do that. Why they got the fat kid up top and the skinny kid? If that fat kid fall down on that skinny kid, bro, that's finna hurt like crazy. I gotta say, you too fat to be smelling bad. That don't even make sense. <laughs> Why are you steady talking about him like that? Talking about fatness never prospers. Damn, big ass forehead. This man look like Megamind. His head shaped like a light bulb. That is insane. How much you willing to give me to get in here? I give shit. Let me in. I'll give you a dollar. You just try to bribe him with a dollar? You could at least say five. Baby, have you been working out? You look nice. You look real fine. I'll keep it Got your stupid ass. <laughs> Got your dumb ass. Yeah, I used to wear Reeboks back in the day, bro. Those things was ugly. Those are nice, but mine are ugly. You know what I'm saying? He <laughs> over here dancing with an overalls on, bro. Not gonna lie, if you fat, you should not wear overalls. I say that with the least amount of insult. His daddy got some PTSD or something. What's going on with him? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, she fine. Then he ran to a little thickums, you know what I'm saying? Now he a little thickums himself, but it works. How many times I gonna tell you I ain't messing with Charlene no more? You ain't even fooling nobody. Everybody knows it's all. She got a big forehead too. So he a player, player. He got babies all over him, messing with all types of girls. Not letting my child grow up be fucked up like you and your stupid ass friends. Facts. I don't need your tired ass anyway. Now I ain't gonna lie, Raheem, you need to stop talking to women like that. What them ugly ass shoes, boy? You can bust my ass, sir. Hey, hey, hey! He said he could bust your ass. He didn't say all the ass. Now relax. You, you beans and rice, son of a. You need to have respect for me. I was almost your father, but the line was too far. So he waited till his homeboy shut up to say nothing. Nah, he a. I ain't gonna lie. You scary as hell. Hold on now. Don't be dissing the Puerto Ricans now. Don't play with them. I'm gonna shoot your peepee off, man. <laughs> no, nah, he said, I'm gonna shoot your peepee off, man. He's on like Scarface, but gay. What's up, man? Extra hey, how you doing? Late, man. I feel good. I got a hard time getting away, man. These kids are supposed to be in school, but they acting like grown ass adults. I'm a little confuzzled. Where are y'all parents? You didn't, you didn't know about Donald Bromwell, man? Donald Bromwell? <laughs> Yo, Donald. What? Not that was trolling him like that. That's disrespectful. He was just trying to front, trying to get some coochie oochie. You know what I'm saying? Don't play him like that. Oh. Whoop yo ass! Do what you told. Give me a kiss. <laughs> Gave him money. Nah, you tried it, buddy. Oh, did you hear Brenda's skin? Did Brenda Witherspoon shine your silver? 
my house. I'm sorry, sir. Did you just say your mother shines your spoons? Can we not say that? That's a little awkward, man. That's a little weird, man. What is in Pop Tart? Let's get it on. Let me get in that ass. What makes you think you can beat me? Okay, what are all these questionable things that they're saying? Like, he just said, get in that ass. Can we get a pause, please? Like, can we get an AO? Like, why do they keep doing this to me? I'm about to just start saying pause every time they say some sus shit. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta get to school. Too busy looking at video games. His ass caught up. Dang, how he jumped that high? I can't even jump that high, man. I, I don't got no vert at all. Damn. Get out of there. I like how this starts with a cop chase. That's wonderful. That is beautiful right there. I was about to say they're on your ass and the cop just fell down the stairs. Let's go, guys. Come on. Y'all better not. Really? That is so risky. I would not even do that. Just to get away from the cops. Oh, he ain't coming. Let's go. We ain't going nowhere without Steve. There you come. They made him go to school. <laughs> How do you even get out? Okay, bro, you ain't had to do all that is so extra you would you could have just walked right past and called it a day Like you are so scary Why is Tupac so aggressive? <laughs> you ain't gotta be so aggressive about it, bro. Relax. You see how Omar Epps is just completely simple talking Y'all yeah, supposed to be my boys, the crew, the wake up. They been all over, man. Everybody know them. They're just local Oh, he called you local. Me personally, I wouldn't let that slide. You know what I'm saying? Local is crazy. Is he finna smooth talk her? Cause I know Omar else got the smooth talk. I know he finna do it. Look at him. She better not turn around and be ugly. Excuse me. Can I help you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> he looked at her so serious after she turned around. He's like, you serious? <laughs> Anytime. Y'all really stealing? Nice go -to I like it. You like it? Yeah. I'm gonna get another one. Please don't get another one. Please don't. Sir, where are you going? Give me back my tape. You can't leave. I'm not paying for this tape. Wow. Y'all ain't had to do her like that. That's her job, man. People be messed up doing that stuff for real, bro. <laughs> Oh, she disrespectful, bro. She ain't had to look at him like that. I just got pulled up a day, man. That shit is cool, man. I hope you taking care of yourself. Word up. Man, it's nice to see you, man. Yeah, pardon me for that. Nah, he, yeah, he looking around a little too much. Hey, yo, Q, you want a piece of this? Nah, man, I'm all right. All right. Just got parole and you just said F it and went straight back into it. You know how much money is in there? It's a day. We are in there, man. Let's just go. I said no, man. Yeah, doing the illegal stuff is not what you're supposed to do to make money, bro. You need to do it the easier way. Oh. That was your woman. Nah, don't tempt him. He over here trying to let it go. You over here tempting him. Bro. Gotta get it right, buddy. Man, do not eat that. It look like vomit, bro. Booyah, pal. Booyah. Ha, booyah. <laughs> <laughs> this man is so funny. He's enjoying this a little too much. What is this man? Making an eggs and hot sauce, man. I mix it like this all the time. You throw this shit away. You ain't cook it right. That's all it is. He could have made that look real good, but he ain't cook it right. You clearly seen this too many times, buddy. <laughs> For you to know all of it. I control my life. I got more control over your life than you do. But I'll give Let's not forget. Okay, bro, stop talking with your mouth full because you look nasty. Gunman was killed in a shootout with police as he attempted to rob the Hollywood bar in Harlem just Dang. They homie died. Just before he himself was killed on the news at seven. Remember you was talking about, oh, let's go, let's get a piece. Yeah, you remember? We went from the cops. We went from security guards. All we do is Run like I'm on a goddamn track team. Does this man want to die? Like, what do you mean all we do is run? That's the point. You don't want to die, right? This ain't sticking up to nothing now. That's because we wasn't there to back him up. If that we was there, it'd be five that niggas instead of one. Like, what do you mean? Are you dumb or something? What are we fighting for? No, nigga, you ready to die? Up, man. Turn your fucking back on me, nigga. Nah, yeah, nah. You're doing a little too much now, bro. We used to be like brothers. All right, we're gonna squash it. What do you say, Bishop? 
I don't like the way he was looking at him. He talking about, yeah, it's cool, but he got the death stare in his eyes. He's like, yeah, it's cool. Nah, I don't like that. Hi, Q. Let him in, Frank. Why are you looking at me like that? Frank Q. Q, Frank. This looks like a therapy session, bro. Be like, tell me about today. <laughs> Uh, you got a whole lot of attitude for someone with an ugly ass haircut. Yeah, hairline is crazy. Okay, Frank, I found it. Remember these? <laughs> hey, what the hell are you laughing at? The chain snatcher? Why are you talking to him like that? Sometimes I be wondering, do you remember that you are the same color? What? Well, that's him, huh? That's him. Oh, he got a real attitude problem. Definitely. Nah, what do you mean that's it? Like, that's your old man and this your new man? Let me find out. Is this an adult and she's messing with a dude in school like a child? Am I connecting the dots right? Y'all tell me if I'm wrong, because I feel like this is kind of weird. That's 10. Gotta get ready for work. Where do you work that you work past 10? Is she a stripper or something? Because why do you work past 10? I'm gonna straighten this out with the rest of the boys, but make sure you get there after you're done. Q and, and what's this dude's name, Raheem? Is that his name? They seem like such pure souls. Like they really just want the good for everybody. But that other dude, Bishop, he a little hot-headed, man. I don't know. He's probably good at what he do. And they just, they just don't wanna, you know what I'm saying? They don't wanna play with him. He good at what he do. Okay, look at see I told you he get up with it. Damn, mama's chicken. Mama's chicken look good as hell. It's in one of them boxes. I gotta get some mama's chicken now. I gotta find where that's at. <laughs> DJ's gotta be creative as hell, because I cannot do it. I am not a DJ person. Okay, hold on. He actually know what he's doing a little bit, but it's kind of repetitive. He ain't gonna mix up the beat a little bit. All right, it's just completely whack. But Face it. Well, you might have a chance if that shit wasn't so small. Oh, uh, that's great. They probably gonna think I can't even impress her because she's too hard. Nah, give him a chance, man. Run away. Make takes for my boys, stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, be local. <laughs> exactly what they said to him. That's messed up, bro. Yep, mm hmm Yeah, she feeling it. I really liked your tape. Thank you. Thanks. I'll see you Saturday night. Where you go by? GQ. Yeah. Yo, yo, my brother. I heard you made that DJ comp. Congratulations. How did they already hear it? He just walked out the door. <laughs> got it? Yeah, I got it. Come on, let's walk. What's going on? Check this out. Y'all should not be trying to rob people, man. Old man Coolis is not going to draw on somebody that got a gun on him. Yeah, man, it'll be a piece of cake. He's really hesitating. He does not want to do this, and y'all are bad influences on this man. Yo, I think we should plan this another time. This nigga's scared. Ain't nobody scared. Why are you yelling at me? This man wants to fulfill his dreams, and y'all are hoeing him right now, bro. House and Bookmaster, Mixmaster Massacre, the ultimate DJ battle of world supremacy. This is gonna be so bad. And then they let him hold a gun, too? Oh, this is gonna be so bad. Up. They got worse dance moves than me. They out here. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> this is kind of horrible. What the heck? That dude has horrible DJing skills. <laughs> it sounds a little bit better, but it still sounds bad. What is going on? <laughs> Nothing got the radio champion going against him. He lost. It's no hope for him. He lost. And his actually sounds good. That's the crazy part. I like the DJ aspect of this whole movie. Like, that's not even the whole point of the movie, but I love the DJ aspect of it. Because it feels like he's the main character trying to live out his dream of DJing. That dude knows what he's doing, though. That's a tough competitor right there, man. He know what he's doing. <laughs> he know what he's doing. Yeah, we like the competition. If there's one thing I love, it is competition, bro. When I was watching 8 Mile and they were doing the rap back and forth, I was losing it, bro. <laughs> now he flicked them off. He knew he did good, yup. <laughs> You get the crowd hype, you know you won. Mm-hmm. Hey, man, he deserved to win that.
Look, and all they waiting is to dip. Y'all are not even real friends. Y'all are horrible, bro. Not cheering for him, nothing. This is disgusting. It didn't look like he said nothing. This man just chewed in his ear. He dead ass just chewed gum in his ear and didn't say a word. And they just made it seem like he whispered something to him. I'm done, bro. You all right, man? Come on, B. Get it together because we're really counting on you, okay? Here come the cops. They really should not be doing this, man. This is so stupid, bro. Y'all are young. Y'all are just throwing y'all life away. You don't want nothing to do with this, man. All right, let's go. Let's go. You better not shoot him. <gasps> Are you serious? Like, what did you even do that for? Oh my God, this dude is such an idiot. You have to shoot him for, man. You didn't have to shoot him, man. You made a move. What move? Right here, man, we got to give it a gun. Yo, Bishop, man, give me the piece. No. No. Oh, now you don't want to get rid of the gun? Nah, bro. I knew it. I knew he was finna be the psychopath, bro. Oh, shit. Are you serious? Nah, you going to hell, bro. You just shot your homeboy like that? Never trust your homie. I, I told y'all, bro. Never trust nobody, bro. Get your fat ass up, man. You gotta run. Still. There should be no reason why your homies are scared of you. Like zero. What the fuck are you looking at? Going crazy, B. Ever fucking call me crazy again? I'll blow your fucking brains out. I got it. The fact that he had to look up so fast, nah. I knew it. I knew it from the beginning that this man had a crazy look in his eye. His mindset was not straight. Look. If I go down, you go down. Nah, that wasn't the agreement. You the one that killed two people. Can't fucking keep up with a man at a party. So. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, your homie scared of you now, bro. You playing too much. Nah, he got the crazy look in his eye. Nah, hold on. Let me find out he finna turn on him. Round two. That's gonna mess up his opportunity too, man. Bro, what are the cops doing here? Raheem is dead. Somebody shot him. Hey, just sit back and be cool. We want to ask you boys some questions. Would you come to me, please? They could already tell the way he said it so nonchalant. Raheem is dead. Somebody shot him. Like, why did you say it like that? Now they already know you're an accomplice or something. You lying. We didn't kill him, though. We didn't say you killed him. We said that you regularly harass Mr. Keeler. Oh, my God. This is okay. One of them is going to go down the wrong path because they didn't communicate this enough. If the cops were to question them they have a secure story they finna fuck up somewhere we want to get the story right from you this way we can protect so we know what's happening this dude is all boogery and serious i feel so bad because <laughs> we're three niggas in a police station doesn't matter what happened y'all want us to be guilty we'll be guilty true and then y'all ain't getting no justice for this man's death too like if he was really our homie y'all wouldn't give a crap about making the other one go down okay. This man looking at his play like, can I have it? <laughs> Fat this dude gonna lose weight. How much he not eating right now? Why are you crying? You was literally the one that rejected him. Gotta stay strong for Ma, though. She's trying to deal with this by keeping busy. She just keeps going and going nonstop. Man, she gotta take a moment to sit down and grieve, man. Been asking around too. Nobody seemed to have seen or heard anything. Ironic for you to be saying that. Turn yourself in, you dirty scum. And he was more than a brother. I mean, we did everything together. If there's anything I can do, just let me know. Oh, he is so nasty. He's like gum on the bottom of a shoe that's been there for like three years. I feel disgusted by him. Like, are you serious? I heard about Raheem. I really like Raheem. He's always nice to me. Did somebody shoot him? Shut your big head ass up talking about I really like Raheem. Hey, shoot! Ah! Hey, shoot! Nah, don't go out there. Nah, I'm straight. He said, you heard me. <laughs> I wonder who this little kid is saying. They have such a cute relationship. Well, you just tell Mr. Cool, man, if he calls, if he comes by, that I ain't here. We'll send it for me. Why you make that face? We'll send you for me. <laughs> this kid is funny. Blackmailed by my own baby brother. Oh, uh, it's his brother? Okay. Hey, you can have it. It's yours. Really? 
You just do what I tell you. What do you say, man? Thank you. Are you even gonna be able to grab that man with your little ass is gonna fall on top and gonna bust his head open? He literally went to the one place that he knew they would not find him. He's still gonna find him there. How much you wanna bet? <laughs> he had to blow the dust off the book. Oh my god, this man is so creepy. See how you been doing? Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Always will be. Just came to see what's up. I don't like the way you blackmailing people. We all go down if you do, because we all crew. You try me if you think I'm bullshit. <laughs> I don't like the way you disrespecting me. I don't give a f about Steel, and I don't give a f about Raheem either. I don't give a f about myself. Someone with this mindset is really fucking dangerous, and you need to get far away. Because I'm the one y'all need to be worried about, partner. Did he just spit in my face? He just said partner and just spit all up in my face like that? That is just disrespectful. You do not want to be messing with people that act like that, bro. When he starts saying that he don't give a f about nothing, he's going to be careless. Like, he not even tough either. Did your mom ever teach you to make yourself known before you enter the You watch your mouth in my house, Quincy. Why are you treating her like that? You cannot respect me in my house, then get out of my house. Go on, out. You're not even going to apologize? You're going to try to grab her first? You could at least try to apologize. Yeah, they're not gonna save you no more. You remember the only motherfucker that used to save you? You killed him. You remember that? Nobody. No punk spick. Oh, now you want to talk tough in his face and shit. Uh, I must have missed that. Oh, oh shit. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, 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 nah. Come on now. Really? Now you're gonna get your ass beat. Oh, no. Riverside, motherfucker. How many bullets does this gun have? Because they only gave him a gun. They didn't give him the bullets. He done shot two bullets in, in Raheem. One bullet in that dude's head. He shot like four bullets right there in dude. Ain't that like a whole clip? <laughs> I'm confused. You am here to see sweets. Is he going to try to get another gun? I really hope that he tells him what happened though. Because I feel like that would be more of an influence to get him a gun. I'm just saying. Dang, she got a lot in there. Are you Lorraine Powell's son? Tell your mother Jackie said hi. Yeah. <laughs> Not his mama just got to put on. You better, man, stop playing. What do you want? Thinking you might like some company. Well, you thought wrong. You still here? You closed the door for like three seconds. Where would he go? <laughs> Literally just stood there. Hey, yo, man, damn. About the time you came home. Bro, this is like a horror movie, and this man is the boogeyman. He is coming up out of nowhere. No kill Raheem. Well, what are you gonna do about it? I don't know. You don't know? Excuse me, I thought he was your best friend. Yeah, but little do you know, it's his best friend that killed him. Yes, it's still. Nah, he knows something going on. Just come down here, man. I'm scared as hell. Who is that? Who the fuck is this? Oh my god, no, something's gonna happen. Thank you listen, if you need me, I'll be at the hospital later. Cool, later. Yeah, you definitely gonna need her. Don't you get tired of this shit? What the f you want from me? Nothing. Damn, no, not big chops. What is wrong with you? I don't know what's wrong with him. He ain't been acting like himself lately. He don't even hear me. He gone. I feel like this is gonna catch on that this this is the crazy one that he lying and shit. You my man and everything, but uh, I'll do him in if I have to. Hurry up. This man's going crazy, but for what though? For power? Like, I don't understand. Hey, Rick Holmes. No. Don't tell him about power. Hey. You know where he is? Uh, thanks a lot, Mr. I'm just gonna not tell his mama where he at. <gasps> oh, no. He's still alive, though. That bullet pierced a whole lot of fat. Damn. Got him. What did he do? Come here, I wanna fuck. Why did they just assume that he did something? <laughs> there, he seen him go down there. I want him to meet me tonight alone. Tell him meet me there at 12. Uh, well, thanks a lot, man. Man, come on, bro. You know damn well. He's not gonna spread no word for free. That's all I got, G. <laughs> Give him a fucking dollar. What am I supposed to do with a dollar, bro? <laughs> Don't shoot me. Please, please. <laughs> Paranoid as hell right now. He got PTSD. Man, that dude do be making some jump scares, though. I don't know what's wrong with him. No, what? 
What kind of idiotic move was that? What kind of stupid nonsense? Now you're gonna die. Like, <laughs> now you have no type of protection. Now you're really dead. What happened? Bishop shot me. He shot everybody. He's trying to frame you. He finally told somebody, please get this man arrested, bro. Please get him caught up before, before this man die. Please, man. What the? Like, look how he just came out the shadows. You gonna shoot me in my back? We've been tight since the second grade, that's true, but I'm not you. You want the gun? Threw it in the river. Yeah, you are pretty dumb for that. My time is now. You ready to die, nigga? Yeah. Uh. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Show him who's who. Lay his ass down. <laughs> Miss bitch. <laughs> we got a doodle aim. That's all it is. Yeah, there you go. This man sucks. He got no type of aim. And then he's waiting to shoot him when he's around poles and shit. Like, this dude is just dumb. Ah. Damn, got an ass norm. Shit. Did he pick a place that's close to the hospital? That would be so smart if he actually did that. Did he do that? <laughs> they look at him like, bro, you're gonna walk in here with a gunshot wound on the arm, bro? Damn, he got in the elevator. Now it's awkward. <laughs> But you look at her like that. Good save. Yeah, you got out of there. <laughs> Good grab. They are helping the crap out of him right now. How you getting the party? Would it bro say something about losing a man at the party? Nah, this is genius. Everything is connecting so nicely right now. Yeah, he gonna try to throw you off that roof. You should not have come up here. He don't got a gun no more. Oh! What? What is happening? How are you missing? Oh my God, this dude is so trash. You're not good at anything you do. Oh shit! Oh, all right, you ain't got to hit me with poles now. This man is cheating. He literally can't win without a weapon. This man grabs everything and 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 somehow starts winning. Don't let me go. Just hold on, man. I can't hold on, man. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. Let his stupid ass go. He deserves to die. Damn. Damn, man. Now the frame is gonna work. You got the juice now, man. Man, he don't want no goddamn juice. <laughs> This man did not want the Jews. <laughs> Don't tell me that's the end. Y'all are gonna leave me right there? F this movie. <laughs> Literally f this movie. Literally f it. They just left me right there. Like they just, what? Okay, that movie was, I don't know if it was meant to be emotional, but it was a lot more exhilarating. You know, it was a lot more excitement for me than anything. I just seen the look in bro's eye. I knew he was finna be the bad guy of the story. But then right at the end, the good dude, which I knew was the good dude, tries to save the day and ends up getting framed. Like that's crazy, bro. That's crazy. I wish there was a juice too. You know, I wish they followed up so maybe we could see where Q is and you know, whatever, how everyone else proceeded in life, you know, after all this happened. It was kind of crazy. The way they just flipped the switch like that though, like bro just started killing everybody. Like he didn't give a shit. Like he felt like he had the juice, but he was really just a numbskull. <laughs> he was going around killing everyone. Now this dude got the juice. Like, I don't know, it's it's weird. But y'all let me know what y'all thought about my reaction down in the comments below. And I do want to say if you did watch to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching this. I appreciate you very, very much. A lot of people don't understand what a reaction to a movie is. So they tend to say things about me talking too much, things like that. But I I don't really care that much you know it doesn't bother me i just want to thank you for actually sitting here and watching my movie or my reaction to the movie but anyways that's pretty much it so don't forget to like subscribe and uh yeah that's pretty much all i have so thank you guys so much for watching thank you for tuning in this has been mj and don't ask about spider-man peace